up everybody what is that what you want you want to show off your creation no i'm just showing you nice oh i see the channels now Ooh, ooh, can I break that? All right, that's my trophy. <laughs> All right, what's up, everybody? <clears throat> All right, so tonight we've got some bounties, we've got some relics, and we got a lich to go get. So uh, that's what we are doing. I'm also kind of like replenishing some of this since I've been using a lot of it. Mm. Alright. So first things first, we're gonna go do bounties. Actually, hold on. Since that's close enough. We're gonna go see Teshin's alt. I don't even know what they called it. Ghost of Teshin, Teshin's Shadow, what was Teshin? Other Teshin. Teshin Teshin. We'll go see him first since we've been doing steel path stuff and collecting some steel lessons. What's he got? Oh, I still need to go get some corrupted hollow keys. What else does he got? Yeah, these are the ones that I need to max them out. Yeah. Mostly to get these. <laughs> and I've got four of these. That's pretty much where I'm dropping those things. I'm not really worried about the Kuva thing. Got three of these, so I guess until I like need those, I guess. But nah. All right. It has gotten cold here in Mexico. Just looking. Uh, yeah, fuck that one. Sun and moon. Okay. That was the only one that I had, I think, right? No, I do have one. This one, uh, wasn't that? Oh my god. I don't have any rifle or pistol, right? Sometimes the old questions can be heard nothing. Maybe we can learn what they think they already know. I can use it. 
Let's go ahead and equip some of these. I think I've got... this Kita Bobita baby girl what is your problem what's your problem huh you want your pajamas leave the neighbor alone I know leave the neighbor alone leave her alone I know she's sketchy I know <laughs> Um, I just need to get this on. Yeah. Uh, I know. I know. I know. I know. I know. It's horrible. There. This, seriously, this is the last one for you. Take it or leave it. Ridiculous. Right, so let's go see what this one requires. Also, I adore the raccoon. Um, let's go do some bounties. Let's go kick this off. We gotta go get some bounties done. Farm that standing so I can get those shards. <sighs> That's all I had to do to unveil that holy shit. Right, two caches without using energy consumables. The fuck does that mean? Oh, pizzas. Yep. All right. Well, we could actually put the hind back in. Now that I know what those are. I forgot to put that back on the on the dragon. Shit. This is a fire. Yeah. I'm sure I've got that one on. <laughs> oh god. What? You ate it already? She's like, yes, it was delicious. Let's do a status chance. Um, while I'm doing that, let's put the dark room back on because I'm going to forget that that thing doesn't have a thing on it. Oh, is it Kuka Dark Room? Put that off. And crap, what was it? Is it this one? I think it was this one. For sure, it was that one. Yeah. All right. Well done, lad. The great pursuits. Can we stand ready? You have your alchemy. I can do that. Kuvasir and Hind on the Zorus. Who's gonna work on the Zorus? I don't remember. This is gonna work. Oh, I said that alone.
I mean, cold and toxin. Oh, this is gonna suck because I've only got two things. So he tosses. I think I missed that. I think I missed that one too. How the fuck am I missing these? I don't know. My gun is doing injection damage to this thing. Oh, nice. Everything fits nice and snug. Nice, nice. Or Good job. There's a lot of endo I'm leaving behind, I'm not going back. It's doing bounties. Oh, the one with the train! You don't see that one often. I don't see that one that often.
let's change my load out because this is going to be a lot harder than I'm expecting. Um, this one is close enough to the dracoon. We can just use the dracoon. Oh, you don't have to go scrolling. Speaking of the chicken thing again. Where the fuck is this? This is really in here. Got one. I need to work on my dark and get some damage in this. Now we got it done. I'm not going for that star.
Oh shit, they took care of it over here. I need to fix the drug code real quick, so... I'm disconnecting. Be right back. Got to restart, basically. Not happy about that. Oh well. Go see if that actually counted towards my bounty for the day or not. No, I did not. That's it. Damn it. Ugh. All right. Well, let's see here. I need to spend this on something. Don't have this. Okay. I'm just gonna do that again. God damn it! Wait, I don't mind doing alchemy. It's more of Goddamn game was just like, yeah, we're gonna disconnect your ass. You can't have this.
And I forgot to make the changes. It's a blast, Jesus Christ. There it is. We got done. Does the Jakun have an Incarnum? That's my next question. I don't have to look this one up. I don't think it does, but 
Dear God, if that thing had an Incarnon, I would be in love. My two favorite shotguns in this game is the Dracoon and the Phantasma. I know there's a Phantasma Prime, I don't have that yet. Is there an Incarno? Oh, that sucks. I wonder if that might be a future thing, because that would be amazing. I don't know that it doesn't look like it's got one. change this up real quick a little bit because I need to fix this. It is not it is not the greatest. Right, so yeah we got the scattering inferno and blaze because it's yeah I might take off the charged shell although I think this is Valence bonus is electricity, okay. I mean, this still needs to be maxed out, so I'm not too surprised I don't have that, but. Okay, 85% fire rates. I might change that one out just for. I don't think I don't have that one. Alright, shotgun barrage. Let's see what the max out of that one does because I don't really think I need a revive speed. So. The difference between those? I don't know. 90. Okay, so we might. Oh, that's why. Okay. Because that's on something. Sentient barrage, no. Toxic barrage, no. no. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, so we'll take this one off and we'll stick on the basic. Barrage. Yeah, right. According to this one, they have. They got these. They crit damage. I'm surprised they don't have that one on here. They said they have primed to cleanse veneer, but I'm not. I'm not fuck that shit. Chilling reload and toxic barrage. I mean, the Toxic Barrage is pretty nice, yeah. Take that one off. Stick that one on. Oh, but that one's... That one's gonna take that down a little bit. Mm. 
I mean, the reload speed is nice, but I'm not going to be really worried about that. We do Hell's Chamber. I like the status chance. The status chance is nice. Damage is nice. I mean, the status chance is, yeah. So what if we take this one off? I'm not going to be really worried about that. Oh, 110, 120. Okay, well, that one's, that was pretty good on there. Could put that one on there. What is making gas? I mean, shell shock is a status chance in electricity. We could take that one off, put that one on. I feel like I'm doing too many things here. I could put this one back on. damage. <clears throat> Got primed point blank. We could do crit damage, but I mean... It's a shotgun, so I mean... Hmm. Sinking, I'm sinking. It's like a status. Because, I mean, take that off. I mean, we can do just a straight up status chance on that one 90% ch status chance. Status goes up to 22, which is still not the greatest. Maybe if I had... I had a fucking ribbon for this shit. I, this, yeah, the Kuga version's definitely better. The only th reason why I like the Dracoon is just the amount of scatter that it gets, like... <clears throat> I feel like, I feel like I could do better. Just, I'm not quite sure where I'm going with this. And I'm looking at Overframe for some, some ideas, and they're pretty much all right in the same ballpark as me. You have the shotgun barrage, um, the point blank, blaze, hell's chamber, and then the other ones are just kind of like, you put them in as you need. Like a lot of them use chilling reload, but I'm not really worried about the reload part. It's just spread. They keep trying to put in a lot of different status on here. I mean, that's kind of what you want to do. Is you want to put a shit ton of status on because it's a shotgun, but. I mean, we could take the crit damage off because there's a shotgun in the end. It doesn't help that the one that got in it has electricity, so we do need to fix that. <clears throat> Mm 
And now I have Corrosive. <laughs> ah! Creation. Uh, but now I think, as I was saying earlier, my two shotgun choices, this one, the Dracoon, and um, the Phantasma. I know that there's a Prime. I don't have the Prime, but I like the Phantasma. So, why do they keep using the Frigid Blast? It's just an additional status chance. I mean, I guess we're just trying to increase the status chance. I mean, that's... One, two, three. I put that on there. I mean, we could put that one off and then add in. But I mean, at that point in time, you're just getting. You're just getting shit at that point. radiation <clears throat> yeah I need to so this is the one that I need to go ahead and get something else because I've got electricity on this one and corrosive is not that okay that's not bad oh yeah I know corrosive is that Vigilant Armaments, okay. I actually kind of like this one. Okay, yeah, no, we'll use this one. Put it on config C because I don't know what the fuck my magnetic is. Ouch. That definitely took a hit, but also these aren't maxed out. Why are they not maxed out? Do I not have these maxed out? Oh. <gasps> Wait, hold on. I don't think I've ever seen the critical deceleration. Crit, crit, if, oh, the, that's my only one. All right, well, let's max that bitch out. <laughs> And here I was thinking, I was like, I wish there was something that was kind of like what I have on my, um, Catch Moon. Because my Catch Moon is ridiculously stupid. And this is similar to one that's with the Catch Moon. At least one that I use. Nah, don't worry. I don't have a Phantasma that I'm working with, so... All I know is that they have a primed version of it, and I need to go get that one because I like the um, the alt fire on this thing. <clears throat> I have to go see what I even have on my phantasma. Wait, give me a second. So, hmm, the crit chance is definitely better. Oh, it allows acceleration is also not maxed. Hold up. Oh, you use fatal acceleration. Ah, we do this one. I'll go play with that. I like the little bling 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 bling. Okay. And then what did I use on this one? It was the merciless. Oh, wait, we got more different ones now. Hold on. Could totally use that one. I don't have a toxin status effect, but that would be pretty cool. Precision hit. Yeah, no, this is a fucking shotgun. Um...
Now just do Merciless. Atomic Fallout. If I get bored, I guess. Okay. Well, let's go give this one a try. Um, let me go grab my Phantasma real quick and slap this on there so I can see the crap. Another day. Actually, this is like a core weapon that actually has formas on it. Oh my god, everybody. Oh yeah. This I was using somewhere. I don't remember where. Just override config A since I don't know. I was actually looking to see if they had an Incarnon for the Dracoon. They don't. And then galvanize it. So, yeah, let's not put that there. So, okay. So, I will save that for another day. But I'm hoping, I'm hoping that we get an Incarnon for the Dracoon because that would be amazeballs. Can you imagine that? Also, look at this fucking skin. I need to find a 3D print of this thing so that I can print it out. Like, it's so cool. I don't remember. I think this is from the Unreal thing that Hellraiser told me about a long time ago. It's such a cute little guy. Just go ka chunk, ka chunk, ka chunk. That's what it does. All right. <clears throat> Thank you, squirrel. Uh, where are we at with this? Oh god, okay. Fools. I think it is too. It's been a while. It's been years. It was the Dracoon, the Strofa. I think it was the Strofa or the Stalta. A Stalta. This one, and there was one more. I don't remember what it is. Hold on. Whoa! Whoa! What the fuck, squirrel? The Dracoon. Oh, the Ogress. Ogress rocket launcher. And then the Stalta. Ogress, huh? Yep, the Ogress. But yeah, no, these these skins are so fucking cool. So, all right. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh my god, squirrel! What the fuck? For legal reasons. <laughs> oh. It's about to be like, scroll it has a sister, okay? I don't know if you actually have any siblings or not, but. <laughs> Alright, so. Oh shit, really? Oh, uh, I feel your pain. My older one is, is Kitty, so. Let's go. Continue. Kitty, if you're watching, I love you. <laughs> you're my favorite sister. <laughs> my only sister, but you're still my favorite sister. <laughs> oh. No, you already got your treats. I am out. You ate them all. 
so I'm being greedy. Okay, okay. Oh, this is a little bit better, yeah. Mr. Fish, you need to tone it down a notch. I am trying the best I fucking can. figure out how to work with the seer it's this pistol I'm leveling up like I feel it at the same time I don't feel it Oh, it popped up over there. Usually I see these things having to get summoned over by like the next location. GTFO, GTFO.
I think I've got one more, but then I got these bounties done. The enemy shall not find us wanting. Uh, I mean, I really like alchemies. I don't know why this particular mission type really is something that I enjoy a lot. does not want to die. Oh! They're coming up from the other side. Oh, shit. <laughs> yep, I'm gonna be alone for this one. Okay. I'm currently just getting the shit to a drop over there, so. Still not feeling the dragon. Like I think it just needs to get a little bit. Like I think an Incarnon would make this thing shine. I really do.
And I don't think they're done with Incarnons either. Nice. Yeah, as soon as I'm done with getting my bounties done, which this should be the last one, I'm gonna go get myself another lich because I need to finish my liches. I want to do some sister work, but I really want to get my liches done. Like that whole entire collection and next. I'm like, so sick and tired of seeing liches after all of it, but you know what? It'll be worth it in the end, and I can mark that off as done and done. Yeah. But yeah, no, I'm I'm on that same, the same, one team, I guess. I mean, I just stopped doing lich stuff for a bit. I don't know how many lich weapons there are, but there's a crap ton. I know that. And then I need to go and do hollow key farming at some point. Because <laughs> Ergo, Ergo Glass, or whatever the fuck his name is, he's got stuff. Alright, good. Bounties are done. And Bird did not have a shard, so. <clears throat> okay, so. Yeah. Let's go get a Lich. Also, 60% rad base. That's how oh, nice. I think in the end, that's something that you kind of want is radiation. Because it feels like that's where we're swinging towards. I don't know. Could just be anything. Significant trauma. 
We're moving the galleon to assess Kuvalich viability. That's what I have now. Oh, Jesus. Hi. Give me a second, let me get out of here. This is a never ending ship. Alright, is this a ship? This is a ship. Alright. Oh, it's already on there. Okay, yeah. <laughs> That's so awesome. Is this a. No, this isn't what we bought. Where did you get this from? I got them. Vic has been making something for his job. This is part of it. I feel like even if I tried to explain it, you're not going to understand. It's a recharge. recharge bay. We'll go with that. It's a, char it's a recharge bay. For um, these little trackers that go in cars, that whenever they pass over the finish line, or well, it's a marker. Timing, Timing transponders. Timing transponders. So they look like this. And then you put them in there. And then they charge. And he's been working on making how many of these? Five in total? Oh my god! <laughs> but yeah, that's good. Look at that 3D print work. Nice. That fucking lid fit like. Yeah, no, that thing fits like a glove. Did you have to, did you have to like coax it in there? It has a lid. It's a lid. It's not, it's. it's yeah, I know that, oh. but did you have to coax it into the hole? <laughs> Hi, Kida. Yeah, I, there's no more. You've ate them all. Look, they're gone. What? 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 The other ones are specials, so. See what it is. You incinerated me once, but your blood bits. The only fire in which we burn is time. And the blood of the queen has blended me. Lily Ju Gastat. That's a name. All right, let's go back to this god awful thing. It's not god awful. I just need to make it work. <laughs> yeah, I need to make it work. Why have I not made those? Do this. You have a lich. <gasps> Are we gonna go lich hunting? I can totally go lich hunting. I just don't need to get ditch the other protea, but that's fine. You know I haven't taken it in a while. Let's go play with Zephyr. Okay, yeah, uh, put that one on. Ah. <laughs> what the fuck kind of name is that? <clears throat> oh. Yeah, let me see, let me see. I forgot, I keep forgetting that they have those things. Nothing. Ew. 29% because, Jesus Christ. 29% fire. Fuck that shit. No offense. I think all of my ephemeras have been wasted on my luck, but... 
Oh, this is gonna be a lot. This is weird playing Zephyr. Oh, okay. Did you want to go work on your Lich? I'm totally go working on Liches. I mean, we can probably burn through it in like an hour and a half. Since you win right anyway. <clears throat> I'm sure we could do that quick and easy. Today, I bought yarn to finish my little pumpkins. See that you see this right here? A little plastic bag full of pumpkins. I couldn't finish them because I didn't have brown and I didn't have green. Finally bought them, so now I can finish them. If not, they just appear. <laughs> so happy. We received intel that somebody's vital to enemy operations is here. Find them and capture them. Bursty things, okay. the full group this is actually pretty good and get these things over and done with That should be like a quarter of the way through. Yeah. It's the end.
think that was it. That wasn't that bad of a first run. Usually we don't get that far. Because they don't have like full groups, so. Yep, nope, and that was that was perfect. <laughs> Seriously, that was perfect. Because that's the other thing that kills it, is when people are just like, run, 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 and you're just like, really? <sighs> Excavation is not too bad. Also, we can get some cryotic. It's been a while since I've played Zephyr. She has a fun one. Got a tube. Oh, that was something I needed to work on. Yep. This weapon is it's growing on me. It's growing on me. This excavator is fully powered. Additional kill cells will be used to restore its share. Moving to the next. Attacker, 
Maybe not move to the next. Oh shit. Out of control. Holy crap. Nice. Got one of them figured out. Go to the next one. Look for the thing.
Is that seriously all the ones that we're going to get out of this? That's bullshit. I was expecting to get a couple more, uh, lich uh, whatever the fuck those things are called. Yeah, we can probably start heading towards the extraction. We got them all done. I don't see anybody else coming, so. Watch the covet at work here. Here you may go. The mission was scrapped, but everyone made it out. That is what matters. Oh, I wonder if it's because we had the goose hang. I wonder if them spawning in ruined the uh the spawn rate of the Lich Lichlings, whatever the fuck you wanna call them. Right, I need to is there a net? Doubt that's gonna be the first one, but we're gonna put it in just to make sure. Do you know? Okay. Oh, there it is. Wood glue. Zig glue. Yeah, that's why I'm wondering if they uh fucked it up. This one wants to go, we do exterminate. So oh, okay. <laughs> But yeah, no, I'm wondering because we didn't get near as Bendy that one. I mean, I knew that people were coming in a little bit later too, but I've seen I've seen people. So yeah, I don't know. I don't know. It is fucking cold here. Bum 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 bum. <laughs> I have to give Kida a bath this weekend so that we can start putting her in her pajamas because it is cold. Operator, are you enjoying your view? Also, I need to find that Velcro. Probably end up just buying some Velcro for her jacket.
Pick a primary, any primary. Core attack. That was one of my favorites. My core attack can still do a shit to the damage and steel path. I'm actually really happy with it. I feel like that's one of one of my primaries I haven't fucked up. Also, it slaps. That one slaps and it slaps hard. Oof. I would ping you my core attack build, but unless you've got a ribbon for it, I don't think it's gonna work. Like if you wanted a suggestion. I mean, at this point in time, I'm happy with it. I just need to find a, a ribbon disposition that makes me bubbly inside. <laughs> Shows up with us. It's not that corrosive. Although that's cool. Oh. oh, what? Valence is that one. Oh, I'm not quite sure how that works. Okay. <laughs> oh, I need to change those auras. This is school. to go get some like socks or something holy crap bring your weights where's the what the weights back there on the table Lots. This, if you're not familiar with Zephyr, for those of you who are watching, fun little fact is that when you spawn the tornadoes, you can actually direct them. Oh, 
There it goes. Just a little thing. I noticed that there's some people who just, they, they don't know. You just don't know. That one's mine. Right, let's see if Nacho's in slot one. Oh shit, it is. I don't know what the second one's gonna be. Holy Rubido and Ferrite deposits, Batman. It's like they just decided to put them all here at the end. Oh, okay, we're going. Are we going? Are we not going? We're waiting. Oh, Amber Star, Amber Star. Amber Star. Get it. Squirrel's like, nah, I'm too good for that. <laughs> you sure? Oh, no. I haven't changed the overlays yet. I need to do that. That's like at the end of the year goal. I'm probably going to take some time off at the end, like in December time. Oh, I have no idea. That one was started by somebody else. I don't like that one. Yeah. Is yours? Okay. <laughs> yeah, defense. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Before, before, hold on. I need to go do kissy wissy kids. I wanted, because I have Sentient Wrath in here, and now that we've got way more to play with, I wanted to play with it that whatever happens, like, that the tornadoes can take on a thing. Could do Thermal Sunder. I don't know if that's actually going to, like... 
Yours is still on Earth? Okay, we can definitely do that one then. Spellbind, Terrify. It's gotta be, it can't be something like that. It's gotta be something that's like a environmental, I think. I don't think sickening. Okay, yeah. I don't think sickening pulse would really work with that. Like, okay, so here, playing this with me. So with Zephyr. Okay, hold on. I think I can do this. I think I can do this. So with Zephyr, um, equipment, abilities. The thing that I'm trying to play into is this. So the second line, tornadoes deal the elemental damage type they absorb the most. So usually you shoot through them, but I think I think if I have like an environmental thing, you know, like um, Ember's Fire Blast, I think they would pick that up. Because I don't, I don't know if they would absorb. I don't know if that would work. Does that work? Yeah, I don't know either. You know what? For science. Let's do it for science. Um. So there's fire blast, which I mean we could definitely do that one as a as a chance. Honestly, that's like the only ones really. Could no, because shock is. Hmm. Sickening Pulse will probably work because that one's I mean, it's already in the enemies and if the tornadoes have it, then it'll probably prolong that. But I don't think that would actually work with the tornadoes themselves, especially since they don't like last forever. Alright, we'll try it. Thermal Sunder. Because I don't like Tailwind. Never have. So let's let's see what happens. Worse that happens, I don't like it. Let's see if that works. Alright. I'm ready to go. Yeah. And that's that's pretty much it. But for like day to day, Zephyr things, that's pretty much it, in my opinion. I feel like that's kind of along with like Protea's number four. It's good for specific situations. The enemy is at our doorstep. We must defend our equipment until reinforcements arrive. Still not how. Yeah, after they did the rework, I don't know exactly how to summon the thing. Nah, it doesn't. Okay. Because see, now I shoot that with that one and got the fire in there, so...
Mm -hmm. Yeah, no. Alright, so that doesn't work. So if that's the case. Hmm. What would be another option? Okay, wait a minute. What are the mixes that go with cold? You got blast, you've got gas. Okay, now I'm starting to think that they actually might be picking them up. I don't know, it's, honestly it's kind of hard when you got other people with you, but I'm not going to complain. Just gotta figure it out, gotta figure it out. Dude, this gun is fun. My little bursty boo damage. Oh god, I said that. Alright. I need to stop watching YouTube late at night. No. So they definitely don't pick it up. Alright. But the enemies that are in the tornadoes get affected. That's why I'm like, hmm, could still play with that a little bit. But at that point, I might as well just put sickening pulse on.
Whose lich is this? Still thinking. And two weapons to play with? Alright, I need to go get some socks on because I'm actually getting pretty cold. So be right back. I mean, yeah, I'm gonna leave this up, but yeah, it's fucking cold. It's supposed to be like in the low 60s for your freedom unit users. I've got, I've got the, the thermal socks on. Oh my god. Oh god, I put it on weird. Hold on. There you go. Okay. Oh, winter's coming sooner than I was expecting. Holy shit. Learning to the uh, weather app. It's 57 degrees. That's oh, cold. Oh, God. It's gonna be a cold winter. Freedom units 57, because I haven't changed those things. That's cold. What that is in Celsius, I don't remember. It's like 13? Like 13, 12? So I don't know. Cold?
Oh, oh, oh. Squirrel's got the friend. And my second one got unveiled. All right. Akita, I know it's cold. You get your pajamas eventually. Actually, no. You just want your treats. I know you. I fucking know you. I forgot what you had to do for this, which is funny because I actually made a guide about that, I think. But um, there's like something that you can in insert in there. And it gives you like a different outcome or something. I don't remember. There's something about this particular mission. Holy shit, there's a kitty. We are going to destroy the injector by operating it at a dangerously high velocity. Keep the grenade at bay until it melts down. Ah, they took my gun. I was like, why am I using the sear? Nice. Is it cold where you are, kitty? Because it's cold here. I had to get the booties. I'll just check the weather app. It said 57. <laughs> Suck it. Okay, oh, it's cold. You just destroyed a massive batch of grenier toxin. Good work. Get to extraction. No, we're going to be having rain every day for a week, according to the, uh, the app. It's gonna suck for Sunday. That means we're gonna have to bring like clear plastic to put on the table. <sighs> what do I think I've got clear plastic to put on the table? Wet and windy? Yeah, 
mean, everybody I think right now is having the tropical storm weather, right? So, I understand the wetness and windy. Okay. Yeah. Um, alright, so, Kra. Do I have a Kra? I do have a Kra. Do you gonna believe me? Sucks. I usually don't wear socks. <clears throat> oh, it's so much better though. All right, so that one, we put crow, and then I don't know, we're going to randomize that bullshit with this one. All right, let's get rid of the Zorus, because I'm not feeling the Zorus. I keep wanting to slam down, and I can't get the Zorus. <sighs> Sun and Moon, I actually have a thing for this one. Oh, get a random one at the start. Oof. Sun and Moon, does this have? I don't think this one's got a prime. Hold on, I want to. I want to make two hundred percent sure. Like a hot, like two hundred percent. I want to make sure. Pretty sure this came from uh, Daviri. Yeah. Seriously, I've gotten into the habit, like, even if I'm pretty sure, I don't trust myself. <laughs> so. Alright, action. I need a blue patat. Wait a second. I don't even know what word that was that came out of my mouth, but a <laughs> blue patat. <laughs> Not a patat, just a patat. Yeah. Patat, patat, patat. Right. I don't know what to do with this one. We've got combo duration, initial combo, toxin, and then that chance to gain combo count is ass. But we'll play with it anyway. Um. We got some toxin in here because I've got that right there. So let's add a little bit more toxin. Why the fuck not? Oh, I only got six left. Fuck it. Fuck it. Ah, oh, Zephyr, Zephyr, Zephyr. You're rocking. You're rocking the wrong lens. All right, get your ass to Mars. We are there. Disruption, fuck that. Mobile defense? We could do mobile defense. Ooh, crossfire exterminate. Let's go. We bought orange flower cookies. I don't know what you call those. You, they exist in the USA. Kind of. Because they taste like something I have had. So orange flowered, orange flower flavored, whatever the fuck cookies. And they are big. Like they are huge. Seems so nice.
not have range on the Zephyr or something? First one. Nice. I lost something, but I don't think things will work better. Oh shit, you already glued it and everything. Oh yeah. Oh, so it looks nice. Oh, that was probably from the previous mission. Oh my god, get the fuck up. <sighs> oh, is that we're just gonna stay down there. Anyway, I actually really liked Wishmaster. It's cheesy, don't get me wrong, it's it's corny as fuck, but I like the premise. I like the premise of, I mean, it, it's a gin. But his attitude about some things was just like, you know what, fuck it. Okay. I find it amusing. Probably be god awful. Although, they would probably try to make it more serious when that movie is definitely not supposed to be taken seriously. So. It's like them trying to remake Friday the 13th as a serious movie. You can't you can't make Jason Voorhees like a serious thing. Or Nightmare on Elm Street. Like those you just what? Wait, they did. <coughs> they remade the Nightmare on Elm Street. I remember that. And they tried to take it a little bit more serious. I haven't seen it. I've seen scenes of it or parts of it. And it's it's bad. Oh, we're not talking about that one. We're definitely not talking about that one. Uh... Capture. Yeah, that's the thing that I have heard. So. And then with the crow, I haven't seen the remake. I refuse to see the remake of the crow because the initial one hits everything right. The aesthetic, like the overall atmosphere, the mood. The lighting, just the charisma of everything, like it captures what was originally done and then whatever the fuck they did it with. Like what?
And this isn't me trying to be like a fangirl for, you know, the Brandon Lee. Like, no, it's they failed to capture the whole entire premise of the crow. I don't know how else to word that from what I've seen. Oh yeah, no. The few parts I saw from the remake of the Nightmare thing. What? <laughs> That's all I can say is what? I don't know, I feel like when people try to do these remakes, like, they just miss the entire premise of what the movie was supposed to be about. It's like, even what it's, like, based off of and et cetera, et cetera, just, I feel like they just miss it entirely. No, I want them to leave too. Unfortunately, that's at least a guarantee that we have a another lich player. That's the only thing. We'll we'll ditch him after next one. This one's just rushing through shit though. You are a tree hugger for O five. Okay. There is a large platoon of Grandin Marine stationed here. Leave no one standing. If the new youth could be built in King's Rome, now another There we go. There's the slam. Ah, oh, shit, I saw it way too late.
Broken. Well done. Now get to extraction. I think they're calling. That's the easy thing. I'm gonna ditch him. Also, I can go check the stats on my some some things here. So, um, Actually, bring carrier for this. Oops, 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 oops. That one. Uh, it's not burst. Super. Yeah, super. <clears throat> Alright, uh, add, add Mr. Squirrel. Into mobile defense. Orders have been integrated with the Valiant's AI systems. You could say we forged a new connection. Hopefully we don't get them again. <laughs> this is a mobile defense mission. Oh, you wait, must deliver payloads and defend a number of locations while I bring in the network. Squiggle. Still working on it. Continue to defend. Stay focused. There is a heavy unit approaching. You are surrounded by Premier Marine. Uh-oh. Area completed. Move on. 
Well, let's see if see if I got the second one right. And if not, we'll know what the other one is eventually. Oh, fuck. I don't know what the third one is. And I don't have that on. The... No! Oh shit, there's a jade in there. I was like, shit, I'm falling off the map. Oberon and Nidus. That's some real interesting foliage. I'm going to have to increase my range. That is for sure.
Use them. That's the heavy unit. Son of a goat. I can't be the only one that hears that. Whatever they say. I don't think I've got any more coming. It's been a little bit. Go who guy Hori. <laughs> Just saw the name of my seer. Oh my god. Hori. Ah. <sighs> Mine is off of Mars. Is yours off of Mars, Squirrel? I moved. Oh, I need to go do uh, this. You can no more resolve a solution. Okay. Oh yeah, cause we haven't found yours yet. I got seven of these. You know what? I doubt mine is going to show up again, but... Our position has been compromised. Defend the cargo until reinforcements arrive. The Dominion used to be built, but now all they do is make war. Is that your dracoon? No, what is that? That is not a dracoon. What the fuck is that? Corvex's thing. Alright.
I like what you've done with the place. It looks very uh, fragrant. Got some plants going on. I know, right? I have to make sure I'm awake for that. We were out today, so... I only got the pre-built form uh, from the, the stream today, because by the time I got back I was like, fuck. But that's okay. I better do some needed shopping, because leaving early ass in the morning tomorrow so mind you we are afternoon people so like we don't get up until like two in the afternoon that's just how we are that's that's early it has to be he has to be at the thing at like 7.40 in the morning? Like, what the fuck? Yeah, I'm gonna have to look it up. I need to make- cause they- it's a- it's a different time, I think. Do not. We're just night owls, so. <clears throat> it's not my fault. Oh, and then there's that. Okay, so I'm in Central, but I'm still an hour off from USA Central because we got rid of Daylight Savings Time a couple of years ago, and the USA never did. So I don't even, like, I still have to do math gymnastics. Like, Cutie's in the same time zone as me. She's an hour ahead. Squirrel is two hours ahead. And that's gonna be like that until November? I think that's what Squirrel said. Was daylight savings time for you or USA's residents? It is almost 10. Yeah, no, it's... Seriously, it's math gymnastics. Have me do, like, if you didn't think that, you know, like, I don't find doing adjustments for time zones, but when you are dealing with ones with DST and ones without DST, plus the time zones, you gotta make sure you're adding that extra thing. Yeah. It's ridiculous. 
It's okay, though. Did I figure that one out? I don't think I did. Nah. Alright. I still don't know why they won't get rid of DST. Like, it does a fucking- it's, it's an archaic practice. It really is an archaic practice. Farmers don't use that shit anymore. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, when I was, when I lived in the USA and I had a job, I always gravitated towards the third shift because it's just, it's, it works for me. It's quiet, nobody fucks with you, it's peaceful, and it is usually pretty outside. And you don't have to worry about the sun, because fuck the sun. Yeah, Kitty used to be, and then she had to become an adult with adults. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Kitty had to do adult things and adult responsibilities, so Kitty couldn't stay as that. Ugh. But usually we... Our super late nights is usually when the sun is up and the one of the neighbor ladies is taking her dog out. <laughs> Adulting does suck balls. That's why I'm happy that we have a 24 hour grocery store right across the street. And everything else you can do online, like pay bills. To work. Jeez. Yeah. <clears throat> oh man. So, if you have to, okay. So you you got first shift life on that. Holy crap. No, it's the third person. Oh. Okay. Okay. I, I, there's times I miss my, my old career, but at the same time, I don't miss the people. I do not miss the people. Is this a Nova with us? It is a Nova. Oh, it's a Mac. Yeah, it is a Nova. This person's just popping all of the things. Oh, nice. Yeah. 
second to last job I had, it was a, um, oh, what was it? She was an independent vet. Just, I can't come up with any other words for that. Like, she owned her practice. It was, the, it was a sole, sole, pro yeah, just, that was her. And there would be times that she would ask me to come in earlier or later and then do all this other crap. And, oh, we have, like, something that can you come in early so that we can do this treatment for this dog because they need their acupru acupuncture, not acupressure, acupuncture. Oh, we need to go do a euthanasia. And I'm just like, Jesus fucking Christ. Not the same exact thing, but it's the, the on the on call pretty much. Fuck that shit. I don't miss that. Dude, I oh god, I miss my car. I had that. Since I since you know I live in Mexico City, there's really no need for a car. Like there's public transportation everywhere. But, um, car that I had was a, oh shit, what was that? Chevrolet. Camaro. Chevy Camaro. <clears throat> and it had, it had the auto start. It had the heated seats. Oh god, it was so nice. I love being able to just like point it at the car and get it to start. Oh, Yahoo! Okay, hold on. Uh, it was a It looked like this but instead of white it was black It's a 2011 Chevy Camaro RS and I found out there's a difference and I have a funny story about why I had to get this particular thing <sighs> Dodge Durango. Oh shit. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> I think I know what that one is. Yeah. Yeah. So, here we go. We're going to have story time. So, I had, before that car, the Chevy Camaro, I had a Chrysler Sebring, and I bought that. I had the money. I straight up bought it. Did not have to make payments. Literally handed over the money. They gave me the keys and the title. I drive off. That is my car. Right? One of the best purchases I ever made. And I made that car last. That car was older than shit by the time it died, died. I couldn't fix it anymore. That engine was going to be way too expensive <laughs> to replace it. So, um, which one do I need? Jehu. Okay. So. With that said, I had two little dogs. I had a Pomeranian and a Cairn Terrier Corgi mix. And it was the Cairn Terrier Corgi mix that scared the shit out of me. So I lived in Atlanta, right? Now, I would have to go from the south side to the north side at some point in time. That was when I started going into university. And I was in the midst of moving from the south to the north so that I was closer to work and my school, right? So I had my Chrysler Sebring. I would fix the shit out of that thing as much as I could. And at some point in time, I just couldn't do it anymore. So one of the things that I had found out with that car was my little terrier mix found out how to operate the windows and how to operate the doors. <clears throat> yep. Yep. <sighs> oh wow, Honda Accord. That's that's a sturdy car. That's a sturdy car. 
All right, so yours moved on to the next one. <clears throat> My pick now, okay. So what ended up happening was when I had to go car shopping, I had to look for, I did not want a four door, I wanted a two door because I wasn't with anybody and I would take my dogs to work. So ideally two door, usually those are a little bit more affordable, kind of. But the thing I had to do was I had to make sure that my dogs could not roll down the windows and could not open the doors. And you might think, what the fuck, Chez, that sounds so ridiculous. It is a lot harder to find those things than you think. <clears throat> And the only car that I could afford the monthly payments was a used Chevy Camaro. And Danu could not roll those goddamn windows down. I would go and um, going down the interstate and Danu, that was my interior mix's name. She would roll the window down and she would like try to jump out sometimes. I don't know why. The thrill of the, I don't know. Or she would roll her head up inside the window. You can imagine as you were driving and then your dog is like choking themselves. Not a good look. And then you'll be like, oh, well, what about child locks? Yeah, that shit. Nah. I have had some issues with that. And then if you're wondering why I don't like the, the four door versions, it's because Kitty had a goddamn car as we were growing up. That decided to catch fire and i'm sorry i don't want child locks on my on my car first of all because i'm pretty sure that if she left me there i would not be here because that car caught fire yeah i'm talking about you that was god awful so yeah there was that does now, nah, man. There was so many things, so many things that dealt with that. So yeah, I wanted a two-door car, just for many reasons. One of them was because of that. No child lock bullshits because, yeah, no, that thing was more than fucking cursed. That thing was a death trap. And then people, run, like the the people at the dealership, are like, "Oh well, you get, but just like a, a child's, just put the child thing on." I'm like, "Uh uh, no." <laughs> yeah. I mean, there was no fixing that thing. That thing entire front dash melted, infused with the fucking steering wheel. So anyway, that was the story of why I got that car. And it was, it was nice. It was nice. And then people are always, and then and then my best friend, I would when we would go driving around like to go do like errands or something, and then he would question my choices in music that I would be blaring Pokemon to be a master on my <laughs> on my my little car thing, and apparently that doesn't fit the aesthetic of what people who have Camaros drive. I'm just like it's my goddamn car. I can listen to whatever the fuck I want. Who the hell doesn't want to listen to that with some <laughs> nice tunes? Oh god. And I'm just like, I'm gonna be honest, when you're like barely awake and you're trying to motivate yourself, that that C D had some really nice movement. Get you going, get your, no, get your blood pumping.
Ah, fuck it. And I'm still upset to this day that my Sebring still took that little clown doll, and I don't know where the fuck like, that thing went with the with, with the car. Apparently, having clown dolls in your car is a great theft deterrent. And I'm just like, I just like clowns. Keep them in the car. Oh, that sucks. Hostage is taking damage. We should probably get going. <clears throat> My is and then, and then I found out that, oh god, there's so many things that I found out that apparently owning your car outright is a no-no if you want to get anywhere in the USA. You have to build credit. So that means that you have to go and be in debt to earn better credit so you can make better purchases. Fuck that shit. Ugh. Oh, just because you own your car, that doesn't really give you a good- What the fuck? Do you own your car? <laughs> no. That's a whole other rant that I'm not going to touch. Two thousand and three eclipse. Sound familiar. It is a Mitsubishi. I was about to say, is that a Mitsubishi? That is a Alright. Was it a soft top or was it the It's probably not a soft top and if it had butterfly doors. Most likely it's a hard top because you gotta have something to anchor that shit.
of toxic damage. Here we go, fun fact, I've never seen a Fast and Furious movie. After this mission, though. Oh, those are the best though when you get some nice deals. Kitty is leaving me. Oh no. I know. You can't kill me if you keep hitting me in the bits I've had replaced. Ow, fuck. Did I do that? No, 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 no. I need the energy you refill. Like a dead man's spine, didn't you? Oh, no, you don't. Get back here and take what's coming to you. Where the fuck did this bitch go? Oh my god, I pushed the right button. Oh, this one is a jerk, that's for sure. Oh my god. Having a little trouble, I see. 
Oh, that's another thing. Automatic is horrible to get used to. I'm not knocking on anybody because, I mean, it makes things easy. Like, not gonna lie. But at the same time, manual, I think, is a little bit better. Used to be that manual would give you better gas mileage. Nasty. It's going, Tabs. <laughs> oh, man, that lich was. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh god. I hope to god they keep that one. <laughs> that one was holy shit. Damn. That one was nice. That was crazy. Yeah. No, that was... That was nice. Like, if that was mine, I'd keep it. I'm still hopeful that they might come out with something that your liches are good with. I'm still hopeful. Cause that one was that was nice. That was nice. Alright. <clears throat> no, I'm leaving. I'm not gonna go with that guy. Uh, so I got a form of this. Okay, something's up with my headset today. Hold up. There's days where it works and then days where it just kind of fades in and out. For mud, my primary. Witness, my control expands to a new sector. Attack. You lack the capacity to stop me. Resolve. Surrender the core. Uh, we shall speak. I need to fucking summon in already so that we can get this done. I mean, the scroll should know what your last one is, right? You should. Hopefully. I mean, it's the point we just need them to come in and 
and murder them down. We have saved intel that somebody vital to enemy operations is here. Find them and capture them. What's up? It's been a while. Yes, it has indeed. The capture target has vital information that we will need to extract. We oh, need shit, where'd he go? Let's see this one. Ah, you bastard. Come here. I do know that Twitch has this tendency, kind of like with YouTube, where people get unfollowed for some unknown reason. I've noticed that. There's some channels that I had followed. I don't know who it was that I followed, but I don't follow them anymore, and I don't remember clicking the button. So. Oh, hey. That's one. Two. Uno, dos, tres. Let's go. Where did she go? There she is. All right, squirrel is next. Yours is probably going to show up next round. Um, so far, yeah. I had my birthday two days ago, right? Two days ago, yep. Yeah. <laughs> Celebrated by getting a Panda Express. It was nice. It's been like a year since I've had Panda Express. It's been like a year since I've had Chinese food, but... Thank you. And then I bought some yarn so that I can finish up my little crochet pumpkins that I'm going to sew. Currently freezing my butt off because it's cold. Ah, thank you. Yeah. I don't think we're going to get any more, so. Ooh, that sucks. <clears throat> Well, let's see here. Here locally, we've got Panda Express, which is in the plaza. We've got a really, really expensive restaurant that's operated by an elderly couple from China. They go visit China like once a year or something like that. But their food is good, but it is really expensive. And then over by the Home Depot, there's another one. I don't remember. It's the, it's not Kapow. What is that? I guess it's the K. Mm. Yes, I did. I just had to finish yours, Squirrel. That one was nice, but that one's also expensive. But you get a lot of food with that one. And they actually, they're still in business too. So. Oh man! All right. And then, those, those are like the only like Chinese food places in the area that we know of slash that we have tried. Sushi, on the other hand, there is a crap ton of sushi places. Including the really expensive one that's at the plaza. <laughs> Next to the beer factory. Oh god, the beer factory is... Somebody came in, activated this, and then left. The fuck? Oh 
man. That sucks. I actually really enjoy seafood. Um, I've never had coconut shrimp until I got taken to Don Pescado, which is a it's a seafood restaurant here. Oh man, coconut shrimp from that place. Oh, that's how you fast travel. So I did not know that. Today I learned. Okay. This makes me wonder what kind of anime, first of all, second of all. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> Assuming that since we're talking about food. Yes, I do know of Tiramisu. Person before I met Vic actually was going to culinary school and he learned how to make Tiramisu. It was debatable. He definitely needed to uh, improve his skills, but it wasn't bad. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> Holy crap. That sounds actually really good. Matcha tiramisu. Mm. I have recently discovered matcha tea. Like this year, I have discovered matcha tea. And I enjoy matcha tea. So now I'm like, you you have me at the matcha right there. Mine? I have Zephyr right now. Whoever's doing the disco dance party is Revenant. Alright, so that'd be Squirrel doing the disco. I'm currently trying out an idea with Zephyr, so her tornadoes do not take on the condition, the conditions that, um, like this, I have, what is it, Thermal Thunder from Gauss on her, and it's, they don't work the way that you would think, I mean, obviously, because I was thinking with the tornadoes. That it would you know absorb that as well but no you literally just have to shoot the tornadoes to make that work but if you shoot the tornadoes and you get them in the fire and then you do that when you the tap you do the cold proc and then you do blast damage to the idiots who are inside the tornadoes so that works not entirely sold on it yet don't touch that um i'm trying to find something because I don't like Zephyr's number one so yeah clearly yeah because it's it's vague the description is super vague and I'm not I wasn't quite sure because it says absorb I'm like, well, does it absorb, like, an AoE thing? Like, you know, if... Because if it works with that, then, you know, I put um, word sites on that, and then... Although... Word sites are a pro Aren't they, like, a projectile? Ooh, that actually might work. Or does it actually have to be weapon damage? It probably has to be weapon damage.
Good job, carrier. You shot them down. Yeah, no, it just says what it absorbs, so... Image is nice, it's not exactly. I mean, we could do that one totally. Hmm. Now, blood altar for Zephyr. Nah, that one could be fun, but nah. So I thought that one at work. I don't know what color I have on. Give me a second, squirrel. I want to change this one out because I'm not feeling the, the thing. Gloom isn't something that I would stick on that. I feel like there could be something a little bit better. Nah. It really sucks that it didn't work. That's almost like Terrify from uh, Necros. Kind of. I don't know if my missive color is bright or not. I think it's dark, so I'd be putting them to sleep. I know a lot of people use Roar for like everything, but that's... Mm -mm. I mean, the sickening pulse. I was thinking about doing that. Smite, you have to look at one of them. Could do this one. Let's try this one. See if it works. I'm trying. I'm. We can do it. We can do this. We can do this. Mm. All right.
Okay, that one actually works pretty well. Oh my god, this is taking us away from the target. Sorry, I had to get them out of the out of the area. <laughs> are really not happy with us here. Oh, yours is over here with me. Switches, it teleports. Oh my god, Becky. No worries. Oh, Jesus. Squirrel, yours, yours touched me and I did not like it. <laughs> Ah, damn. Take care of yours first. Okay, never mind. Person, other person's on me. Okay. That was unsolicited touching. Oh, there's some teleports. Oh, the teleporting ones are always the hardest to deal with. Just 
Because it's like, oh, I see them, and then no, you don't see them. Tell me that my audio is on. No, it's off. <laughs> that made me nervous when they said, What? Like, what? Let's go dispatch. Oh, okay. So we still have to go do another one. Okay. I thought you got it all in order. Oh, okay. Nope. Lead the way because I can't start it. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Boris is sorry. Happy to report that Carmichael Jelf are gone. Murder hobo time. Squiggle mark. 
quick on my Very so squiggly. Oh, that was uncalled for. Get him! Get him! We're good. Need some help here. Ooh. 
Ooh, I can't strip them to that. There we go. What? Why would you leave the squad after that? Okay. Yeah, people are weird. Right, so speaking of weird, are we ready to go to dispatch? You got yours done, right? I think. Maybe. Yeah. Oh, I guess they're ready to go too. Maybe not, okay. Ah, uh, damn, I don't have anything to drink right now. <laughs> What's the button to get off again? There it is. You're gonna give me a minute on that one, Tabs. Oh, I think we got coffee still. As long as it happens, okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. I think we have to get that last one. I think I only have two double charges when we start up. I don't remember if it's two or three. Or, or you can, you know, exit and go pew pews. That works too.
don't know where this thing is. Cephalon side, tell me where. It's destroyed. Yeah, no worries. It's always so far away. Always turns my ass around whenever we go there. Dispatch. I can't see. There it is. It was always the 
Lit Mug. Oh, I had one with a similar name with that. Well, that one melted. Did I teleport too soon? I think I teleported too soon. I think I did. I think I teleported a little too soon on that one. <laughs> Think anybody noticed? <laughs> Another job well executed. All right, squirrel. Hopefully, you got something that you needed. Maybe. Back to my orbitor. I need to go get something to drink. I gotta see if we got coffee. If not, I got the inbox has messages for the operator. Anything about orbit, Seymour? Right. Oh yeah. I have to replenish my air support charges because I've been using them a lot in the steel path missions. Alright, this valence fuse. Alright, so if we do option one. It's 31.9. I'll figure option two. Yeah, yeah. I would do heat. Do heat. I want to keep doing this one. It sucks. But I went from that to the other one, so. Mostly because the heat one usually gives me a little bit better procs and stuff, but like. Oh man, yeah. Mm. Oh wait, I can. I can. I need a potat. I need a potat. I don't think I've got enough for another one. No, I don't. Ugh. We can do it next week. Oh yeah! So I know that tomorrow we have the new stuff that's coming out that they're, I mean, they're over in Japan, um, Warframe. So they have something going on tomorrow. I don't know what time. I honestly don't know what time. I'm going to already be up because I have to start my day early. <laughs> so. 
but oh really i thought it was early ass in the goddamn day but that makes it easier all right so it's 10 p.m eastern that means it is 8 p.m central for me here in mexico 9 p.m central for usa so all right Yeah, that's what I wanted to see. I just want to see the new stuff. So. I don't think there's drops either. But, you know, hype. So. Mm. Ooh, that means that's going to happen when I'm streaming. Ooh, how am I going to do this? I have to figure something out. Because tomorrow is Guild Wars 2 and I got I actually have some stuff I wanted to do, so I don't know. Alright, I will see you guys tomorrow no matter what though. So oh wait, I gotta do the whole entire sign off ready. <clears throat> Alright, boys and girls and everything that's in between. That is it for me this evening. We have obviously the thing for tomorrow, the new content that's supposed to be dropping soon TM that's going to be before War from Night to Nine at the end of the year, so um, but yeah, they got the announcement and then like the, the stuff tomorrow as, as well put for 10, 10 PM Eastern. So I want to look that one up, like make sure I have it like up somewhere. But anyway, um, tomorrow is Guild Wars 2 stuff. Um, I'm actually going to be going into World vs. World and seeing how that has changed. I don't know if I'm going to be happy about that or not. So if not, we'll go back to PVE land. So, but I'm, I'm tempted to go into there and see what's going on. So, um, I will be around this weekend. I don't know exactly how much because since Vic is going to be gone, I'm going to be alone doing a lot of work for, you know, one person to do the stuff on Sunday. So there's that. And for those of you who are in the Vampire the Masquerade, we've got some stuff to talk about. Which that is the things that we do on set well, every other Saturday. Um, although I think it's just Hellraiser and I that have talked about that. So there's an announcement coming for that, I think. Other than that, I will see you guys tomorrow. Until then, take care, stay safe, stay warm. If you're in the freezing cold land like we are here, but see you guys tomorrow. Bye. That's it, man. Game over, man. It's game over.